Dude. You ain't gonna believe it. Dude, you ain't gonna believe it. I can't believe it. Good morning, folks. I'm excited this morning. I'm gonna go metal detecting with a friend that I've known for a while. He is an award-winning illustrator, author. Let me introduce you to Fred Kaler. This is Fred. Fred, uh, you're here today. Tell me what we are doing. I know you asked for uh, some assistance. You're, you're developing a character or something, right? That's right, that's right. So uh, I write and illustrate uh, both uh, uh, picture books and middle grade novels, and I'm working on a new middle grade novel that has got a character who loves metal detecting. Yeah, so you picked up his metal detector and you've been doing some research and we're here to get some ideas, right? That's right, that's right. We're gonna learn a little bit. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna learn from the pro. All right. All right, folks, right off the bat, the man has beat me to it. He thinks he's got a coin or something. Here, let's check it out. Right, Shallow. Right let's check, see what he's got here. First dig of the morning. Oh, oh, yeah. oh nope, not, not gonna be the dime. You know what I call that? Piece of slag. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look. Maybe they did? What is oh, that? It's I don't know. Pointed, man. Man, dude. Oh, dude, I know what it is. What is it? It's from a toy gun. Oh, yeah. See the trigger, girl? Yep, yep. You know, there may be more down there. i check. That is cool. Let's hey, see what else is there. Right off the bat, I get a weird, weirdness in the hole. 32, which is very strange. Dude, I found something strange. I don't know what this is. This is uh, maybe a flashlight. Oh. Where you, I don't know. Oh, yeah. I bet it is a lot. Part of it, yeah. That's cool. Yeah. It's gotta be. Let's check it out. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. yep. right there I think it's a coin sure enough first penny yeah big 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 let's see nineteen seventy five and another twenty five hit I'm pretty sure this was a coin There it is. Number two. Oh, Fred's working it hard. Good spot to check, always along that sidewalk. You know, this has got to be an area where people park. I'm on my third coin, or third signal. Two coins pulled out of this slot. And I think this would be number three here. Okay, it's out of the hole. Bring it up as a 25, which I think is a penny. Let's go down and take a look. There is the coin. Some nice patina to it. It's been in there a while. Not a wee penny. 1981. Dang, long time ago. 1981, I was working for the city of Lakeland as a jailer. That's right, they didn't call them correction officers back then. They called them jailers. What a job. All right, let's see what Fred's got. All right, let's see, let's see. What do you got, You got it out of the hole. Yep, yep. Oh, Ooh, sweet man. It's an old key. Nice. That's a nice. What was that ringing up? Um, it rang up. On mine, it rang up like a quarter. It says number 16 on it. Ooh, could be like an old hotel key or something. Yeah. Very nice. Awesome, man. All right. Always cover the hole up. Look at there. Yep. That's what we talked about a little bit earlier. Try and dig it so that the. Get the plug just right here. See, you won't even right tell that here. thing was out, man. Yep, again, mine's saying dime. 
So we're doing a little test. My detector showed that it was a dime as well. Which you never know, folks. I had a 25 on mine. What do you got on yours? What reading does it come out? What's that? What read numbers it come out? It comes out 81. 81 on his. So let's dig and see. We'll compare these two together. We've got something there. Both of these detectors are showing that there's a coin or a good signal indicating a coin. We're gonna check it out right here. Well, there it is right there. You see it? Yep. Is, is it, it a dime? It is a dime. Can you tell what year? <laughs> My old eyes, huh? Let's see, let's see. I know it's hard, I can't tell half the time. It is a 2000. 2000. Awesome. So both detectors showing a dime. Good signal. Yep. Good dig. Cool. Coolness. Here, that's yours. You found it. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> hey, if I get a little bit more, I can get a slurpee on the way home. There you go. So I have a writer friend who was at Barnes & Noble. He saw two different people buy his book. And, uh, and they were standing in line, and he was kind of back, sitting back watching. And he was so happy that he saw those two people buy his book that he went and bought himself a cookie and broke even. <laughs> oh my God, see what I got to put up with folks this morning? Goodness, that's crazy. <laughs> let's dig it, man. All right, let's go. Another penny, unknown year. He's killing me, man. He's telling me he's got to target another. Dude, sweet. That is honestly, I like this one better. I like the, uh, yeah, the, the or, ornate. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Fred's on a roll. Oh boy. Dang, dude. So I got it right here out of the hole. This is a 25. There it is. Big penny. Penny plucked out of the hole. Am I getting another hit? Huh, let's check it out. Huh, another hit, I don't think it's a coin, but let's check it out. What is that? Gigantic washer. Getting a 21, 15. It's really bouncing around here. Got a mixed signal here. Let's see what we got. Oh, dude. Look. Something popped out. That's it. Same signal. What in the world? That That looks, I'm not sure what that is, an old fence top or a piece of a, I don't know. That's cool. cool. Yeah, awesome. Nice. Yeah. I got a plain old uh, huh. belt. I don't know what you call this thing. Yeah, a little buckle off of a, that's cool. Eh, not Very as cool nice. as the Boy Scout stuff, but. I know. So I love stuff like this because I'm going to go home and clean up and try to figure it out. What the heck? Yeah. What is it? There's cool fun. I know. It's waiting on me. I love it. You never stop learning. A Facebook fan told me about this. It's one of those things on this truck that you see that eats up the asphalt and it just spins around. There's a photo of a couple of them right there. And thanks to that fan for telling me what it was because. I was clueless. Mystery solved. Right there. right there it is. Penny. That was pretty deep. Oh. You gotta be kidding. Oh, I'm not gonna touch this. Hey, Fred. Come here. You ain't gonna believe it. Dude, you ain't gonna believe it. I can't believe it. I'm serious. 
I hadn't even touched it. Okay. I was heading to the tree because I love oak trees. Yep. Look. Look what was on the surface. No kidding. You got to be kidding. It's right there. I don't know if it's a ring or an earring. Pick it up. Oh, yeah, that's a ring. Dude. Made in Taiwan. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that was exciting, man. Yeah! Gum, sitting right on the top. That is so cool. Good gracious. That is so cool. I don't care if it's not gold. Just seeing that ring sitting on the top is awesome, man. That made my day. Maybe I'm catching up to old Fred here. Oh, I think he's got something else. Very good check on. He's going in here. It's not gold, but it still looks very cool. Nice. It's right here. Still some. Still a penny. What is that? That's an old button. Is it? Yeah. Oh yeah. That is cool. Nice. Yep. It's got a oh, horse nice. and rider on it. That might be a Boy Scout button. Yeah. Nope. I think General Stonewall was here and this fall off his coat oh, <laughs> on yeah. his way to yeah, Fort that's Meade. What I meant. Yeah. <laughs> Man, he, what, let me see what you got. He just hit like a, that's usually like an ashtray drop or something, or somebody sitting in a chair. That's sweet, dude. There's more here. Yeah, well, this, pluck him out, man. Yep, there's one. There's one. Oh. Hey, you doing? It's in there. Boy, howdy. There's, there's just more to come. I want to see what year one of these nice. is. Let me see that one you just got. Oh. oh. I think this is his six penny just plucked out of that hole. Something else. Boy, howdy. Boy, they're all over the place, man. Yep. Two more. Two more. In the same hole. <laughs> yeah. Oh, another one. Goodness. One more. Dude, you're so hooked now. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter. Be another one? Yep. Yep. Fred's still working on it. Got another plug out. Right by it. More pennies. I'm not sure if he's up to eight or nine. Pennies for him. Yep. Dang, man. Is that another one? Yep. yep. Nice. <laughs> yep. Another penny. Yep, there we go. I can't wait to edit this one. <laughs> Can you see it? That's 79. So, some of these. Huh. All right, Fred is killing it, folks. Wait until you hear this. Check it out. Ready? All right, so I found what I thought was a dime and started digging, and it turned out to be a trove of pennies. We've got over 20 here, some of them going back to the 1960s. That's crazy, and it started out in this one hole, right? Kind of went to either side of it? Yeah, and I don't know if we're done yet. We might have to uh, detect around a little bit more, see what else might have fallen. <laughs> we'll be here another 20 minutes, <laughs> probably. Good find, man, awesome. Okay, just to recap <laughs> that hole, Fred went back and you found how many more? I have at least a dozen more. Well, there was a dime in there. Um, <laughs> yeah, got, uh, probably 30 plus of the dime and that's great, man. Yeah, yeah. That was a nice. good, fun day. Let me know. First quarter, come up as a 29.30. There you go. I get them hands nice and dirty. Woo. Just right. as we're about to go, Fred pulls one out of the pocket. This may be the first real thing I've found. What? This looks like a jewelry case to me. Come on. Come on. An 
I. Can you imagine if something? Yep. In there? Yep. It is a jewelry case. I'm confident of it. Or no, it's a metal tin. Sorry. I thought it might have jewelry in it, but it could. Yeah, it could. You may want to just take and clean it up. I think it's metal on the outside, so that might be all that there is to it. But I thought it was no, one of those. No, but that is, dude, that, that, I would clean that up really good. It was covered in something, but. Oh, oh there it goes. There it goes. Okay. A moment of truth, man. The old fabric, but that looks cool though. <laughs> Just that little piece of tin, you never know yep. a kid's treasure thing. Yep, I don't know. See, that's what I love about this man's the rush of it. Yeah, that yeah. is oh. sweet. I was hoping that was a oh. <laughs> nice. I think I got it out of the hole. It's in here. Oh, what is that? Ooh. Is it a badge? What does that say? Add ultrasound. What the heck? I'll have to look that one up now. Hey, folks. Just wanted to check in real quick. Let you know, I haven't been metal detecting in like weeks. Why? Because you can see behind me the house is a mess. We're having tile put down this week. We just had the house painted. The furniture is gone. We have no furniture. Uh, we will have furniture eventually. So, hey, it is what it is, but it will look good when it's done. I hope you enjoyed that video. That was Fred and I out metal detecting. I think Fred is hooked now on metal detecting. There's no doubt about it. He's still gonna write a book and have the misadventures of this kid metal detecting, but Fred, hook I tell you he had that nice little coin spill that was really cool uh, had a great time so folks if you enjoyed that video right behind me on that blank wall where I used to have a TV at an entertainment center hit that subscribe button hit like hit comment ring that bell so you get notified of the next video that I upload and remember I have a website www.coptech81.com you can check out some really cool videos, uh, merchandise. You can leave a comment. You can email me. Check it out. And guess what? I'll see you on the next dig.